So who's coming to dinner tonight? Oh, just you, me, Greg. <clears throat> My cousin. I uh, what? She's just kind of a lot. What do you mean? I don't know. She's like so threatened by us and our success. She always like has to make it about her and tell us how great she's doing. It's like, dude, nobody gives a shit, okay? We know you're still a hostess at Red Robin. Okay. I'm like, no, I don't care. It's just like the posturing, you know? It's weird. I know her TikTok can be like off-putting. Off-putting. The litany of videos of her butchering famous movie monologues. I would rather watch Britney Spears dance with a kitchen knife than watch your cousin on TikTok. Okay, wait, I have to see her. If I don't, my mom will kill me. I just, please, it's a family thing. I just have to make things kosher. All right, I'll go. But I'm telling you right now, the second she starts monologuing, I'm out. Oh, she won't. She won't. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 so Gracie, a little birdie tells me that somebody might have just booked a new co-star on NCIS Cleveland. Fingers crossed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but okay, did I see my Spotify correctly? Mr. One Million Stream? Are you kidding? That's oh, huge. Uh, thank you. Yes, it's very exciting that the podcast is taking off in the way that it is. It, you know, it gives us something to do before we go back to filming, you know, and that'll- I got an audition. Oh, nice. It's, gr it's great. What uh, what for? It's a student film. Uh, I can't say more. I don't want to make you guys sign an NDA, but we were just all talking about like what we were doing. So, <laughs> so are you guys dreading festival season, or is it just me? Yes, uh, I feel so silly saying it, but like as soon as they told us that we had to open the festival, I'm like. I don't want to go to Sundance anymore. They want us to talk about the film that we just made. It's like, I, I don't have anything to say about it. Go watch the film. If we could go like normal people, I'd be totally about it. Mm. The interviews and the step and repeats and the networking, not to mention the autographs. Ah, I literally hate giving autographs. It's like, I don't go to your job and make you sign a piece of paper with your name on it for me. What am I, UPS? What do I have, a delivery? <laughs> you know, it's just like annoying. Sometimes I just want to like live my life and like go grocery shopping, get some fruit, go home without being accosted. So. But um, anyway, uh, Brandon, by the way, <laughs> says he uh, wishes he could be here. You know, I think I'm going to give him a pass because who doesn't work for seven years and then lands the lead in a Marvel? I would never say this to him but it's going to his head, right? Like For you sure. can see it on his Instagram page. Oh, the PJ post? The PJ post, say private chat. It doesn't warrant an abbreviation. Thank you. He's inviting the conversation, you know, he wants someone to comment, what's a PJ? It's a private. Right? There is nothing more annoying in this world than people that like are not humble on social media. It's like, we've all been on private chat. It's like kind of embarrassing for him that he feels like he has to like showboat on the internet. It's like if you have real success, you don't have to do that. I'm sorry, you just don't. By the way, I did just want to thank you guys for not like making a thing of me being here. Sometimes I just want to enjoy a meal with my friends. <sighs> However, I would like to let you guys know that if you would like a photo with me after this, I can make it happen. I would just ask you guys that you don't post it on the internet because I don't want people to know where I am. The Matrix is All right, everywhere. I think I'm gonna jet out of here. Oh. Please don't, stop. Yeah, look, I told you I can't do this. What are you talking about? Look, I know you're my cousin and my mom made me see you, but you don't have to do all this. Do all of what? The monologuing, the posturing, the hey, hey, we're all successful. It's like, just shut the f up. My brother saw you serving at Red Robin last week. I'm unfamiliar with that establishment. She wasn't even the server, okay? She wears the bird costume and she, she runs around entertaining the children. First of all, that is performing. I don't get paid one single dime. I volunteer, which means I do it for free. Second of all, this is quite a sad turn of events because lo and behold, some people here are a little bit jealous of other people's success. I'm talking about you, sir. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'll be leaving. I'm sorry to do this, but I just can't be around this toxicity. It's bad for my skin. I'm going out the back. Don't tell anyone I was here. The photos are off the table, by the way. Cousin on which side of the family? Yeah, it's my, it's, it doesn't even matter. Can we get the check? Shut up and sit down.